Hello everyone and welcome to Anthem. Uh, we're basically going to take a first look at Anthem and give our thoughts and opinions on how it's going so far and um, see what we think of it. So, first impressions. How, how, how are you feeling about Anthem um, after our long wait to play it? Uh, yeah. Uh, so far from what we've seen, I'm liking it. Um, it has some things that I would change if if I were making this. Um, the few of the menus are a bit... I uh, don't know what the word is. Annoying? Yeah, a bit clunky. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, it seems to be a common thing with new games these days where they, you have to go through 20 different menus just to change one thing. I don't quite know why they do that, but, yep, it's in this as well. Mm -hmm. um, player connections, uh, like us two grouping up. We, we've had a couple of issues with it. I mean, this is a demo, but uh, hopefully they uh, iron some of this out by the time it actually releases. Yeah, I mean, so far, I'm, I'm liking it. Um, I'll be honest, when I f sort of started seeing the videos coming out for it, um, it's it looked like it was going in a direction that I might not 100% like. But so far, it's enjoyable. Um, I like, uh, the first of all, the look. The, the graphics are really, really nice. Um, done very well. And um, like the just the movement and kind of how you get around is cool. I don't get on with the flying yet, but <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Hmm. Um, but yeah, I second the um, the interactions between you and the the systems of the game are just a little bit all over the place, and I don't know, it just feels a bit messy, and like there's not much explanation as well, really, um, unless you're willing to like read all over the screen to try and figure out what you're doing. Um, but um, maybe there'll be I don't know, tutorials or something when it, when the game actually is released. Um, but yeah, no, I'm, I'm liking it so far. It's um, it's a shame for the for the demo that you couldn't just pick a um, a javelin that you wanted. You know, you kind of have to start um, in the what is he called? The scout or ranger? Uh, ranger, that's it. Yeah, um, that's a shame. It would have been nice to be able to just go straight in and try out whatever I wanted. But yeah, um, yeah, we'll see on that. Um, but um, yeah, no, so far I am quite pleased. Yep. The sound is just amazing when you're shooting rockets off and blowing everything up. The, uh, yeah. It sounds really impactful. Yeah, and when um, like you fight something massive and it does some big area effect thing, you, you almost feel it because the, the thump and the thud of all the sound is just done really, really well. You definitely need a decent headset to play this game on. It, you, you wouldn't do it justice if you play it on a crappy headset. No, no. Uh, um, Control-wise... Apart from the flying, uh, uh, getting used to the flying, what, what do you think of the controls? Yeah, I quite like them. I think they're quite intuitive, actually. I was worried um, that it was going to feel like Warframe to me, and I don't know what it is about Warframe that offends my hands. I just I struggle to 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 play that game, um, but this feels really quite fluid, and you know, moving around seems pretty competent. Um, the the melee I find is a little bit odd in that you literally, you can't kind of charge up to someone whilst meleeing. You have to kind of get right in front of them and then melee. It doesn't feel very uh, natural. Um, but um, other than that, no, controls are cool. Yeah, I, I don't, don't, I don't think I've really had any problems. The, the, the ranger melee um, threw me off a bit because it's, it's like on a cooldown. It's like an ability. Yeah. So you do it once and you got to wait like about two seconds for it to get off cooldown, which can be really annoying if you're surrounded. Yeah, you want to be able to like Warframe it and just like hack and slash people. Yeah. <laughs> you know, even if it is a weaker attack, but you can do it multiple times with a little bit of a knockback, that, that would be cool. Um, but yeah, it's, it is a bit of a, a shock to the system when you kind of, you go, ha ha, and you hit someone and then you go, okay, I have to wait now until I can hit you again. It just seems weird. Yeah. I think... Um, the the styling of it, the visual styling is is done really really well. Um, I liked the fact that when you, uh, I mean obviously I've turned motion blur and stuff off, but like when you're flying around, it does feel fast. Um, 
and um, and when you're just doing the kind of the slow pootle around, um, you actually do feel like that is slow. It's weird. They've got a really good um, the 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 feeling of speed in this game is done really really well. Yeah, um, and I, I do like that. Although I think the flying is something that I'm going to have to just get used to because I don't know what it is. I think it's because it's not responsive. So, you know, when you um, you think, right, oh, I need to pull up. And so you move your mouse, but you practically have to, I have to like drag it off my mouse mat to actually like pull up um, because it's got a really slow ramp up time to move. Um, and that is going to take a bit of getting used to. You're going to have to kind of read the road ahead and plan your movements out because I kept crashing. <laughs> as you'll see <laughs> but um but it's still fun and there's nothing better than being able to just suddenly take off and fly yeah yeah it's got a really nice feeling when you're just zipping around and then you, you come across a bunch of baddies and you've got like your options do you do you uh attack from range on high or do you fly down and smash them in the face yeah feels really good um, yeah liking it so far and story-wise interesting um in the demo we get one sort of story quest segment um we don't know what the end of that is because the quest bugged out on the last cutscene <laughs> so we, we don't know yeah. what the outcome is that's probably a good thing um actually we, we'll be able to find out when the game goes live yeah be interesting to find out if that was actually by design yeah um <laughs> but um yeah, I liked it. I liked kind of um, the the back and forwards, back and forwards things a bit um, has always annoyed me about games like this, like Division, like you know the other ones where you have you have a hub and you keep going back there. Is that it slows down the pace of a game because you go right, I've done that bit. Now I've got to go back. Then I've got to start here. Then I've got to walk all the way to there. Do you know what I mean? And it kind of it slows the pace of the action down a bit, mm. which may be a good thing in certain times but sometimes you just think no i just want to continue i want to go on and do the thing i need to do and you can't you've got to go back and talk to some dude um and given that they've got comms it, it that that sometimes detracts a little bit but um overall yeah. i liked that i liked the story the the voice acting was really good as well so um that makes a big difference yeah i'm liking the, the story so far the characters seem pretty good and like you say the voice acting's yeah. quite on point now um, yeah, I've got no real complaints about that. It'd be interesting to see what yeah. the um, yeah, you know the the big story arc will be in this game. Um, yeah, judging by the kind of strange quest that we did with a multiple man or whatever the hell was going <laughs> yeah. on, um, I can see that they're going to go a bit out of the out of the box with this one. Yeah, yeah, that's good as well because. You know, the last thing you need is just a, a really kind of um, down the centre kind of storyline. You want something that's a bit off the wall and make it interesting. Um, yeah, I, uh, I'm, I'm liking the direction of this so far, and I think this is going to be definitely going to be one we're going to enjoy playing. I think for a while. So yeah. One thing I have to point out is that if you look at the um, the Hulk um, <laughs> on the main screen, it looks like he has an afro. Oh yeah, um, which you will see um, while we're talking. You, you once you see it, you're not going to be able to unsee it as well. Um, the dude has an afro, so um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Looking forward to unlocking some new javelins and uh, trying out. Uh, probably the Colossus for me is going to be the the one to look for. Yeah can't remember the name of the sorcery one. Um, Storm, I think. Storm, yeah. Um, I think that's going to be my go-to. I like the look of it. Um, but I'll have to try it first, see if I actually like the... They spend a lot of time in the air, and that worries me because <laughs> I'm not so good in the air, but maybe that will force me to be better at it. It's a... So overall, quite impressed. Um, I suppose the real test would be uh, kind of end game ish because once you've done the main plot, um, is there going to be any point just grinding harder difficulties for better gear? You know, what, what's going to be yeah. the point of that? Um, yeah, um, they're definitely going to need some, um, you know, like WoW did at the end of at the end game there with raids and reasons reasons to keep going because um, 
if it is just going to be like division where you just grind and then fight random people in a in a weird zone i don't want to know yeah yeah definitely definitely needs a um a reason to pick it up again because um that's the biggest problem with these sorts of games is that they make them massively like well not massive in multiplayer but co-op at least but most people who play co-op games they play them for the long term and they like that kind of social aspect of it um so when a game ends and there's nothing left to do it's kind of like oh <laughs> move on yeah so yeah i hope they come up with something that keeps us wanting to come back for more Okay, so that's our thoughts anyway. So um, without further ado, let's get on to the footage. Let's see what this game actually plays like. Enjoy. All right, there's mines. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'm sensing something. Scars. No shit. <laughs> Don't know. Oh, down there. All right. Yeah, there's fucking tons of them. Oh yeah. Yeah, they saw me. Jesus. Oh my god, these explosions make it impossible to do anything. It's ridiculous. What's that? In them. Oh, some of them anyway. Am I genuinely out of ammo already? Oh my god, this thing's gonna be a nightmare. Frozen. Fucking big change dude. Gun. Change gun. More spawning in. Yeah. Oh, there's a big guy. Okay. I'm fighting a fucking whatever they're called down here. Um, big dude. Combo. He's down. Ow. Freeze for some reason. Oh, I'm mangled. All right, let me go get some help. Those down. Those stars were quick to attack. Do you think they ambushed Sumner? Wouldn't rule it out. He must be in the area, but he might be hurt or worse. We need to find him quickly. Yeah, so the sniper rifle Tell has very like little ammo. Depends right. on what you think it is. The reason Jump. why Sumner stopped moving. Yeah. Woo. It's a javelin. Badly damaged. Ooh, javelin. Sumner's not in the crashed suit. He must have taken it off for some reason. Hello? Freelancer, is that you? Sumner? Matthias? Yes, it's me. Bloody scars. I knew I couldn't take them and there was a crack in the rock. And you couldn't fit into it while wearing a javelin. Wait, I think this passage leads me to the room I was looking for. I'll keep going. Stay where you are. I can handle myself, and I'm already here. There'll be another entrance. Meet me inside. <sighs> A 
was that summer? He's trapped underground somewhere. How's Maddie? None of his major organs have liquefied. Yet. Major or organ? What about the non-major organs? Uh, just bring back the manifold and summer as soon as you can. Okay, apparently I'm spacky and can't jump forwards. There you go. Whoa! Oh, sweet Jesus. I'm frozen. I'm down. Uh, throwing a freeze grenade. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. They explode when they die. Yeah. I've, I've, I've tried to run away, but I've actually fallen. I'm really not very good at the flying on this. <laughs> Bleed and crikey. Okay. Is the... So, coming down into melee range with those was not the best idea. Yeah. Oh, wow, look down there. It's like. Oh, yeah. Things in spiky porcupines or something. <laughs> need some health kits. That's what I need. Hmm. Sumner's in. Are you sure? No. I'm a cipher, not some kind of cavern oracle. I guess there's only one way to find out. Not a fan of these shadow explodey fuckers. Try and take him out from here. Yeah. Uh, no. Apparently I'm not hitting anything. What the hell's that about? Oh, there we go. What's going on there? What is that over there? Um, I don't know. Boom. It's Ripley, whatever it is. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Shoot it. I just disappeared when I went near it. <laughs> Weird. Stay here and it's not immediately. I've got a what do you call it? Ultimate. <laughs> uh huh. I'll get the attention. Yeah. Right. Over here, boys. <laughs> no. I'm just gonna stand there. Ah, fuck it. Let's just do it. Oh no, I'm too far away. Never mind. That wasted that. They tried to blow up on me or something. Oh, 
Oh, I'm frozen. Oh god, I'm in trouble. Come on, please let me go. God, there's a really big dude. Really, really big dude. Ow. What the fuck was that? Yeah, he's hard. Oh, wow, yeah. Okay. Boss time. Incoming. Watch out for the uh, heat wave. Oh, my God. Oh, no, I that's... tried to avoid him. Couldn't. Oh, we're wrecking him, though. Oh, yeah, he's not super hard. He's down. Oh, out of ammo again. No, he's not. Oh, he's doing no damage for a minute. Jump the rings. Down, you fuck. Yeah, he's gonna blow up. Oh, God. Oh! That was close. <laughs> Chinese! Um. Yeah, not enough um, ammo for that sniper see. rifle. It's just not, um, it's not cost effective. I don't think it doesn't do enough damage. This LMG is a bit low on the uh, ammo. Um, yeah, I'll probably get like sort of three and a bit clips out of it. Yeah. Running things. Oh god. It's like their melee can cancels mine out. It's weird. Yeah. What the? Oh! Ah! The data we need. Ah, what the hell's that? Real drive to... Oh, crud. Sumner, what's happening? Don't go near the orbs. Yeah. Three titans. Oh my god. Leave it to me and fix that relic. Okay, now. Oh. Ow, ow, ow. Fucking ow. Fast nuke. Oh, damn. Can't shoot me or something. Uh, one's down. Oh, I'm getting fucking mauled. Coming. Pink wave. Oh. oh no, I'm in trouble. Oh Jesus. I need health. 
found some. Yeah. Oh. oh, come on, let me get that. Let yeah. me get to that health, please. The other one uh, down the back somewhere. Oh, yes, I'm gonna see them both right now. I think I go ultimate. Punch it. Yep. Oh, that hurt. He's down. Did him though. Get away. They're both down. Ah, oh, quick! Get to the loot. Give me the shinies. Make it easy to get the the shinies. <laughs> Four seconds to lunar around like a nothing. 